Okay, so there it is. You can see the engine jumping around quite a bit. I'm not sure how it looks in the video because sometimes the video smooths things out. Um, I would estimate the engine rocking side to side by a good 10 millimeters. If you look up towards the EGR valve, the top there. see it's kind of rocking quite a bit side to side that's I suppose the highest point so you're going to notice it the most and believe it or not it's still probably only you know 10 mil side to side up and down a few millimeters as well but you can see the difference to how the engine would normally be running it's quite obvious yeah now, funnily enough recently we've made a few videos showing you what not to do don't worry about taking this oil cap off and that little pressure amount of blow by is normal now we're about to show you what's not normal okay so just get it up a little bit you're not going to be able to see a lot anyway but hopefully you'll see something you see the difference the compression from that what would be going making power and out the exhaust there's no seal there so it's blowing straight down through the piston at the bottom and that compression is blowing out the oil cap there right and that's why depending on the size of the hole and how you drive the vehicle running the engine like this can end up popping seals and doing other damage as well because you've got a high amount of um, blow by there right That's what it looks like if you've got a cracked piston, okay? That's your diagnosis. You don't really need to plug in. You don't need to strip it down. You don't need to do a compression test. That is a cracked piston. Try a different angle, eh? So this one's pretty bad. They do vary, I suppose, on the size of the hole, the crack or the hole, because it starts off as a crack. It doesn't happen like a light switch. It doesn't just go from being perfect to bing, it's got a hole in the piston, right? Slowly over time, wrong combustion. Now, you can even see the oil on the ground. So this is gonna be another telltale sign. You can see the chuffs, you can see the blue. People call smoke gray and blue and white. There is different color smokes. This is more of a blue smoke. Well, I'll just call it oil smoke. So it's what burning oil looks like, basically. Um, like that, it looks pretty white, so it can be a bit confusing. Another reason we do these videos to try and hopefully explain and show people what's what. You can see the oil on the ground, right? So there's quite a bit of oil in the intake. Um, in the intake, I'm say, oh, I said it wrong. Anyway, oil in the exhaust. Anyway, so let's go and have a look at the engine, though. Eh? 